Hello, this is Rob Hirschfeld, uh, CEO and co-founder of RackN. But today I'm not talking about RackN or Digital Rebar. I am giving you a studio tour. Uh, I've been doing uh, a lot of videos. As if you've seen some Digital Rebar pieces, you've seen me do this and on TFIR. Um, I've been actually building out a little bit of a studio so I can do some more easy production. And with the work from home excitement lately, uh, people are asking me to see the studio I built. So this is the best video you're gonna get because I'm using the 4K camera, but I'm gonna show you how the whole rig is set up uh, and sort of start showing, the, showing you the pieces. So first, I'm gonna shift over a little bit, show you what my desk looks like. Uh, that's sort of the overview. You can see I have a uh, single big monitor. It's actually so big I should have gotten a curved one. Two smaller monitors on either side um, that allow me to have a lot of workspace uh, so I can track Slack and chat. I can track calendar um, and other items and then have actually multiple display areas for my, my work zones, including terminals, coding areas, multiple browsers up. I love tabs. I have lots and lots of tabs. Um, and then, of course, I do have, this is my 4K display. It's actually in, mounted in front of my screen, as you can see. I, and then I have a separate pole-mounted camera, so I actually built a webcam attached a pole to it so that I could manage um, the system. That's down here. And so in that view, I'm going to shift it over a little bit. Uh, you can actually see um, how my uh, Zoom, this is what my Zoom would look like with my webcam mounted in front of it. Um, that is actually a much bigger view. It's not as good a camera, so it gets a little bit blurry at times. And uh, you can also see sort of the backdrop. So I have a, a drape behind me, and I'm going to show you how all that stuff works. Let me switch over to my phone and flip the video for you. Okay, so now we've got the video flipped. Let me back up a little bit and show you what's going on. So this is my desk. Uh, you can see my pole mounted camera. You can see my overhead uh, camera running here. I'm gonna move that out of the way, which I often do during the day. And then this is, this is literally just, I can flip this down, turn it off, very handy. But it lets me uh, actually look straight in the face of people, look straight in the face so that uh, I don't have to have things off center. Uh, other things of note on my desk, I actually have Synergy set up, so this is actually my, my travel laptop, and I can operate it from my single keyboard mouse, which is very handy. Uh, this is the edgelab.digital, so this is a 4 pi cluster using power over ethernet um, attached in, and so I actually have a full physical cluster over here. Over here, what I've got is a uh, Dyson fan, very quiet so it's handy normal fans are pretty loud and so having a quiet fan is really helpful uh, it's got my nice view in my window uh, it's sort of dark outside so it highlights uh, this is called Cheney Day it's a metal cloud if you know my penchant for physical infrastructure it's a nice homage and then I have a pipe desk where I actually run the CPU it's all top mounted because I have a um, rising desk and with that rising desk push the button down here and I use a kneeling chair normally or standing and so I need a considerable amount of rise in the system so that uh, standing desk allows me to do it the pipe shelves mean that the cabling is all above I don't have to worry about them running behind and then if I step back what you'll see is I have lighting the 4k camera actually needs a lot more light than the webcam and so I have as remote I just changed colors a little color wheel because it's an LED light system and uh, I can control how much light I have depending on the situation this is only for the 4k camera I, I normally leave this off uh, from that situation but it's super handy and that took me some time to work out there's actually some some rails uh, actually detachable, detachable mounts and magnetic clipped in there super handy and then the drape is attached to the ceiling using magnets. So what I did was I got binder clips, some very strong magnets, and then what happens is I just use this poster board to hang it so I have a way to lift. I don't need to get on a chair to lift this onto the ceiling. Down here I have some counterweights that secure it, and that uh, provides my full studio. Without that drop, I still have some nice uh, maps in the background, I like maps, and uh, the couch, my dog is 
normally somewhere on the floor, but you've probably gone to bed already. Uh, and that's pretty much my studio. So if you take a look around, that is uh, all the pieces and parts. The boom mics are really helpful because of the desk coming up and down. Let me switch back over to my webcam. So thank you for uh, spending a couple minutes looking at my studio. I hope this was helpful. If you have questions, please feel free to ask me. Um, it takes a long time to get a studio just right. Uh, and I'm always evolving and adjusting. I, I like magnets, so there's a tons of, ton of magnetic clip things in here. Um, but, you know, building a really good studio is important. Multiple cameras are very helpful uh, from that perspective. And it's taken me some time to tune it and get it working. I hope this was very helpful to you. Um, 